Hello dear traders, I'm Anna Kasatkina. You're watching daily financial news from InstaForex. Euro versus US dollar trades were quite calm in the first part of the day. The bleak CPI report from the Eurozone added to the uncertainties about further ECB moves. There are various opinions regarding the bank's meeting due tomorrow. Some experts expect the monetary policy to be eased. Anyway, today all eyes are on Eurozone services PMI. Analysts had thought the composite PMI for the currency block will hold steady at the level of the previous month, which is 51.7 points. But the result appeared to be worse than expected. The index grew by more than one point to 53.3, which is the highest reading in two and a half years. In Spain, the activity in the services sector abruptly weakened. In France, the index ticked up, yet it still remains in the negative zone. At the same time, the PMI in Italy jumped by 3.5 points and thus broke the 50-point mark. This surge was far stronger than what experts had forecasted. As for Germany, the PMI climbed from 54.4 to 54.9 points. The euro was rather sensitive to every report. Paired with the greenback, it was quoted between $1.37.32 and $1.37.44. Since the interest rate is going to be revised, the euro has not done any sudden hikes. Despite the annual CPI was flat in February, the analysts pointed to other signs of potential deflation. JP Morgan Chase said the current state of affairs in Eurozone looks very similar to what was happening in Japan in the 1990s. The Eurozone is currently facing slow GDP growth, its banks are increasingly hesitant to land and the exchange rate keeps rising. Twenty years ago, the Bank of Japan was insisting there was no threat of deflation. This is exactly what the ECB is doing now. And as economists at JP Morgan Chase suppose, the defeated expectancy will be a heavy blow to the Eurozone economy. And this was daily financial news from InstaForex. Thank you and goodbye.